Hey everybody, this is Cypher. I'm gonna show you the neutral monk abilities. So the abilities that all monks get no matter what their spec is. Um, so as long as you're a Windwalker or Brewmaster, you're gonna have an energy bar and a chi bar. And if you're a Mistweaver, you'll have a mana bar instead of an energy bar. So for right now, we're gonna work with an energy bar. So the main ability is uh, Jab, which is your main ability to build chi, which I currently have four of. So it'll most likely be a part of the rotation. Two other abilities you get pretty low on. Tiger Palm. It requires one chi to use. And it does a little bit more damage. Another one you get is Blackout. It at the moment it requires two chi. Um, and then it refunds one chi if used to kill. It's basically an execute. And can't actually use it on the target dummy unless I get a specific proc. So I'll come back to that. Another ability you get early on is uh, Touch of Death. This ability is only usable on NPCs and they can o it's basically only going to do the amount of damage the amount of damage it's going to do rather is how much HP you have. So I have 140 so if I use it on this target dummy just did 140,000 damage and it can only work when the ability is going to kill the target so they can't have more than that now for your slow it's a uh, ability called disable At the moment the icon looks like hamstring now this is a stacking ability you use it once it reduces their speed by 25 percent and this ability costs energy use it again it reduces their speed by 50 percent then a third time will snare the target for eight seconds I believe it's only three against the player. Uh, the next ability will be Paralysis. This is a form of CC. I believe it will last for 30 seconds used on an NPC and it costs 20 energy. See, he's incapacitated for 30 seconds. Any damage will break the CC on this person. Uh, they also have a Disarm, which w which is a range disarm, 40 yard range, one minute cooldown, doesn't have any uh, resource cost, and it will just take the weapon out of the hands of whoever you're targeting, and it does not work on a target dummy because they don't really have any weapons. Uh, next ability will be their interrupt. This interrupt is kind of unique. It's a 30 second cooldown, and used from behind, it works just like any other interrupt. Unlo or locks them out of their that magic school for five seconds but if you use it from the front it'll actually silence them for five seconds so as you can see right there target dummy silenced all right now since I'm windwalker spec uh, this little thing here sometimes procs and it lets me use blackout kick so I'll just use that to show you guys it's pretty hard it's an execute and if you're Windwalker spec, you get an ability that sometimes procs it, similar to the old school Sudden Death for Warriors. All right, next ability is a ranged ability. It's called Crackling Jade Lightning. Uh, basically, stand there and you channel it on the mob. Kind of looks like a Force Lightning ability. And if the mob were to come up to you and melee you, it would knock them back. It doesn't do too much damage, at least not as a Windwalker compared to other things. So. It's a pretty decent tool for pulling, but not sure what its main purpose is going to eventually be. All right. Another spell they have is called Expel Harm, which is a little bit buggy at the moment. But what it does is you can use it anywhere and it'll heal you for a little bit. Uh, and if you're supposedly, if you're near a target, it's going to do that damage as, it's going to do that healing as damage as well. But I don't think that it works against, against these target dummies but I'll try it. Oh, yeah, that yeah, it did. Okay. It just comes up as a white damage. So, right now it's not healing for too much when you have 140k HP, but I guess it'll help. Uh, another ability that all monks are going to have is healing sphere. Now, you basically it's a 1.4 second cast and if you have an energy bar it costs 60 energy and it's going to put a, s a green globe on the floor. You can put up to three of them on the floor. And if you run over them, they'll heal you. 
so I'll just put them down. And 28k, 13k, 13k. Not too bad. Alright. Next ability is the AoE standard ability for all monks. Spinning crane kick. Uh, it does damage every one second and it costs one chi to use right now. So, and it does damage in a 360 degree radius. Do it again. Okay. Next ability is Meditation. Uh, this ability is pretty cool. It um, will it'll take all the caster damage that's being done to your group and it'll send it to you and it'll reduce all that damage by 99% for 8 seconds but if you get hit by any melee attack it'll break it so a stun of any kind and a melee attack and this is what it looks like and it's a pretty good raid tool I imagine and it's pretty good defensively I guess if you're just using it for yourself and another defensive ability they have is fortifying brew what it does is it redu it sorry it increases your HP by 100%, but you're not allowed to be healed during that time. So you could use it defensively, but you could also use it at least you can use it at the moment in conjunction with Touch of Death, which will do uh, your uh, HP value as damage. So instead of 140k, I use it, it gives me 280k. So if I Touch of Death this. 280k on the target dummy. And those are all the main abilities. They have a couple other ones that are standard. They have a buff, Legacy of the Emperor, increases strength, agility, and intellect by 5%. Uh, taunt, it has additional functions as Brewmaster. I'll get into that in the Brewmaster video. Detox is or dispel. Only Mistweavers can remove magic. Otherwise, other monks are limited to removing poison and bleed effects, which that's a first for me, seeing a bleed effect removal. And the last one is uh, their res, which is kind of interesting too, because if you're in melee range of your target that you're trying to res, it'll reduce the casting speed by 50%. And those are all the regular abilities for any monk, any spec. And thank you. If you want to watch any of the other ones, subscribe and check out the other videos.